Welcome to Threaded South. My name is Ashley and in this tutorial I'm going to teach you how to create a world tour tee. So you may have seen these of course with popular artists when they go out on tour but I'm going to teach you how to create a fake one and you will learn all of this in Adobe Photoshop. You will get familiar with blend modes and masking all that great stuff. Also as a reminder everything that I'm using in this tutorial is linked in the description box below. Let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is create a new document and make it 16 by 20 CMYK 300 resolution and also name your file. I'm naming mine World Tour T and I changed the background color to black. Go ahead and type out the title of your tour and for this example I am using To Whom It May Concern. And center it on your document and change the color to CC DC 29. Change the font size of to whom to 154 points. Change the it may to 215 and concern will be 159. And change the letting here to 119. Warp your text and select wave and click OK. Now we're going to open the angel that we will be putting on the right side and I will rename the layer and edit transform flip horizontal. Right click convert to smart object and drag it over into my document. Now I will resize it and position it to where I want it on my canvas. and change the blend mode to hard light. Create a mask and select your paintbrush tool and mask away the bottom portion of the statue. Make sure that your foreground is the color black. Open up the other angel file, rename it, and convert it to a smart object, and go to select subject, and mask away the sky area. Drag it over into your document. and change the blend mode to hard light. Select the mask and mask away the bottom area of the statue. Create a new layer underneath the selected angel statue and name it shading. Fill it with the color black. and change the opacity to 38%. Select all three of these layers and place it in a group and rename it. 
duplicate the text layer and move it above the angels layer and move it a tad bit to the left a few times and change the blend mode to dissolve and the opacity to 7%. Open up the metallic texture. And drag it over into your document. And position it over the text. And make a selection from the text and create a mask. Change the blend mode to overlay. Go ahead and type out world tour at the bottom. I'm using Adriana. This is of course a Adobe font. So I will also have a link to a alternative free font in the description. And change the tracking to 2,370. Now we're going to type out sincerely forever yours. And we're going to change the font to Quentin. And we're going to make the font size 36. and change the tracking to zero and the color will be ccdc to b and also change the spacing as well so it's a bit tighter Enter your text as well. Create another text box and type out the year of the tour. I'm using 2023 and change the color to white. And change the size to 134. and drag it so that it's above the world word tour. And we're gonna edit transform skew and we're gonna angle it just a tad. And now for this last part, I am going to copy and paste some tour dates that I saved earlier and place them right underneath my main graphic now for the front of the shirt because this is the back of the shirt that we just worked on create another file with the same dimensions and we're just going to drag over the font layers the metallic texture layer and of course the world tour 2023 so select it in your layers panel And drag it on over and here I am just resizing it because it's going to go over the front left pocket. If you like what you saw today, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Also, if you want to grab some merch, head on over to threadedsouth.com. Thank you for watching. Oh, oh, oh.